big three. It's going down. It's the championship. Ice Cube is here. So many people came to support. The stadium is filling up, so keep it locked right here. It's getting lit in here. It's the big three I have with me. Tommy Andre. And? Uh, Nancy Lieberman, coach of uh, Power. That's right. Got it. Tell us, what's, what's the secret sauce? If they keep our players healthy, then I can coach them up. If we're not healthy, it doesn't matter. Nancy, what's the hardest part about coaching this team? It's actually not hard. It's a blessing. I feel very honored to be the coach of Power. And, you know, we're coming off the championship, winning that last year. We've got incredible young men in our locker room. And uh, I deeply admire their commitment to this game. What is the biggest, you know, difference that you feel that has defined the big three? Certainly the NBA is the greatest basketball league in the world. Sure. But these guys have given their life to the NBA. Sure. And the fact that when you get in the half court, basketball is three on three, and then there's, there's two players on the other side of the court. So essentially, all you're doing is taking away the weak side defense. You have to play with precision, you have to have high IQ, you have to have a physical and a mental presence and awareness. Because every play, there's physicality. In five on five, you know, you can stay away. See, I could play in the NBA in five on five and not get hit. In three on three, I would get killed. So it's a great game. It's a strategic game. And you can see these guys still have that enormous will to compete. And then there's basketball players that are now trying out for the NBA that are playing in the big three. Do you have any feeling about that? Yeah, I do. I think it's it's fantastic. Last year, Xavier Silas went from the big three to the Boston Celtics, first time ever. Joe Johnson now is getting, you know, five, six opportunities to try out for, for NBA teams. He's only 38. And when you have somebody who takes care of their body and then you have people like Tommy and Jocelyn keeping you healthy, LeBron talks about he spends a million dollars a year taking care of his body, hyperbaric chambers, uh, the, the, the pool, the water, the, I mean, what these guys do to keep our guys healthy is amazing. So what is one of the secrets that you can tell us to, that you give these guys to keep them healthy? It's surrounding yourself with a good team, and that's the probably the secret. Got it. One last question. What do you feel about Ice Cube's play in all of this? Do you feel like he's doing well as, as far as growing the league? Ice Cube is an amazing man. Uh, I always say you never know who your boss is going to be, your next boss. Yeah. The fact that we get a chance to be with him every week, to see his commitment to excellence. He's the hardest worker here. He's humble, he's kind, he's iconic. It's one of the coolest things that's ever happened to me to be able to work side by side with him. And he's extended all of our careers and we should all be very thankful.